If you're trying to launch Roblox on your smartphone and you get this message, it says security threat detected and shows a reference ID here. Now ensure that you follow the instructions very carefully and they'll guide you on how to fix the issue. Now currently, this is a very common problem. If you go to various forums like the Roblox Help subreddit, you can see lots for complaining regarding the same issue. Now this is a bug caused by the recent Roblox update that flags any modifications made to the app or any rooted devices. And it seems many Huawei phones that uses all these apps like Gbox, Gspace, Google Fire that creates a fake or virtual Google ecosystem on devices that doesn't support Google natively have been hugely impacted by this. Now the fix that's worked for so many people, you can try this. Only ensure that you download Roblox app from the official Google Play Store. So if you download Roblox out of the Google Play Store, maybe like on various sites, ensure that you only download Roblox app from the official Google Play Store. Also, try turn off or EM unlocking on your Android developer options in settings. You can open your developer options. And if you see this feature, just call the OEM unlocking on your Android developer options in settings. Ensure that you turn it off. If you don't have developer options, you can enable it by doing the steps here. Go to your settings, scroll down and select about phone and you'll see build number. You just need to tap, to tap this build number seven times. Once you tap it seven times and the developer option will be enabled on your settings. And once it's enabled, go back to your settings on about phone here. Scroll down just below about phone, you'll see developer options. Either below or above about phone, you'll see an option which is called developer options. So just turn off OEM unlocking on your Android developer options in settings. If a device is rooted, unroot it. If a device is unrooted, uninstall any root installers, managers, and checkers. Anything that has to do with routing should be gone, and I mean everything that should be, do the trick. So there are popular tools that are used in routings, like this one, which is Root Checker, King Root, Majisky Manager, iRoot, Root Master, One Click Root, and others. Ensure that if, if you have any, have any other apps like this, ensure that you uninstall them from your phone. Also, some people reported that you can try to install a block from the site, which is called the, the Delta Executor. So you can just go to this site. Some people have reported that this has worked for them. You can just go to this site here, which is Delta Executor. One of the biggest disadvantages of this site is because it has so many ads, but some people reported that when they try installing Roblox from the site, it worked for them. So make sure to visit this site and try to download for your device. For example, if you're using Android, just select your Android and proceed to the next step and try to download the Delta from the, try to download the Roblox app from this site. If it all fails, then wait until the developers fix this bug. In the meantime, you can try using another device to play Roblox. You can help report the issue to Roblox so that the issue gets more attention by going to this page. The link will be available on the description of this video. Simply fill out this contact as information, including your username, first name, email address, and confirm email address. Then what device are you having the problem with? You can say you are facing the issue on your Android phone. And then just yes, simply select here, it's a bug report. And then here, select a bug report again. Now here you can describe your issue, explain that you're facing this error, which says security threat detected. And you can provide this reference ID for you as the one which you're facing on your phone. You can simply type it here, then click continue to follow the instructions on how to send the information. So that's it, it's a bug, and we hope the developers will fix this issue in the coming days. In the meantime, you can try these steps and I hope it will work for you. Thank you so much for watching this video and see you next time.